two sets of straps here that are also made of leather. Where are they doing that at, at Coach? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alyssa, AKA Always Alyssa J. And today we're gonna be talking about the Coach Rogue bag and whether or not it's worth the money. If you're not familiar with Coach Rogue bags, it's one of their more high-end signature styles. And while you'll find that most Coach bags will retail for anywhere between five or $600 or less, because there's some bags that are even around the $200 mark. The Rogue bags are typically $900 or more, depending on the style. Now, I happen to have a bag in my possession that is $900 and another that is $1,000. Let's get into them. This is the Coach Rogue 25 color block in tea rose and snakeskin. And this is the Coach Patchwork Rogue 20. This bag here, still has a price tag on it, was $995. This was an anniversary gift from my husband. And this one here was $899. This is one that I purchased myself. Or actually, I'm wondering if this one was maybe $700, like $699 instead of $799. I don't quite remember. But either way, it was up there. After seeing the bag in person, I totally understood why it cost as much as it did. For a long time, I, I feel like I was like many people, especially as someone who frequents the brand pretty often. I was like most people and I was like, what's the hype? Why does this cost so much? Why is this so much more than all the other bags? And if you talk to anyone who works at Coach, they will tell you, Yes, girl, it's worth it. But it's different to have someone tell you that versus having the bag for yourself and being able to see all of the good details for yourself. But long story short, after seeing this in person, my husband showed me a picture before he got it for me. But after seeing this in person, I a thousand percent understood why this bag was as expensive as it was. Both of these bags actually. And this is coming from someone who owns Chanel bags, from someone who owns a vintage Hermes bag. Looking at the details, the craftsmanship, you name it, this bag is a thousand percent worth it. This bag is a thousand percent worth a thousand dollars. And once I show you guys the details of this bag, I think you'll fully understand why it's priced the way it's priced. So getting up close and personal here, I just wanna show you all of the details with these flowers, guys. Look how beautiful this is, how nicely designed and beautifully cut each flower is, and it's all leather, guys. I need you to understand, like, all of these pieces are leather. And then the care, the level of care that they were able to take with this bag. There is, let's see if we can see it up close here. I'm trying to, like, you see, like, they have the wrapping around some of the flowers. Not all of them, but some of them, right? So even the way that this is packaged up, oh, it's a little dark right here. But even the way that this is packaged up was handled with so much more care. And granted, Coach does this with a lot of their bags. They make sure that things are... Um, they make sure that things have this, like, little thin foam just so things don't get damaged in the mail or in transit or what have you. So I just wanted to show you that piece first and foremost. Then you have the tag here, right? Look how beautiful that is. Again, all of this is still leather. This is all still leather. Um, then you have these snake skin handles. Like, let's see if we can get up close, up close. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Now I'm going to show you the sides of the bag. Okay, this, these are the sides. This is the bottom of the bag. The bottom of the bag has feet, which we love bag with feet. And then look at the back of the bag. What do we have here? We have more flowers, guys. I'm so sorry. This lighting 
is so abhorrent. Then as you get to the inside, okay, also straps, okay, so in addition to the snakeskin straps you have here, if you want to carry it over your shoulder with both of these straps, you can do that as well. They are removable, so they don't have to stay here. Then you have the interior. Again, all leather interior as well, guys. Like, you know how some handbag brands will cut corner on the zipper. Maybe the zipper isn't quite leather or other parts of the bag that aren't quite. No, every, every inch of this, with the exception of the hardware, is leather, okay? So you have two slots here on the side um where where you can put a bunch of stuff then you have some slits here you see where my fingers are going and then obviously you have the center i'm going to open up the center for you to see okay there's still stuffing in here now i haven't quite taken everything out but this is probably the only piece that isn't made of leather uh the, this or suede uh the interior here i think that looks like uh not canvas but it's woven it's a woven material well you can fit a lot in there pretty much long story short however back to my original conversation here about whether or not it's worth it almost every inch of this bag is made of leather almost every single inch. And this is a lot of bag, guys. This is not this is not a small bag. Like especially in comparison to the 20 here. This is not a small bag. This is a sizable handbag. And for those who know coach, you know the quality of their leather. The leather they use, the bags last. This is something that I'm going to have for a very, very long time. And it's still going to be in pretty good shape at the end of that time. So again, after seeing this in person, seeing how beautiful it was in person, seeing the craftsmanship, seeing the sheer amount of leather that this bag is made of, I get why they're charging $1,000 for it. And I think... That's very fair. Again, as someone who owns a number of different leather bags from a number of different luxury houses, this bag is 100% worth it through and through. You, you, you can't complain about the price for the quality that you're pretty much getting. Quickly switching over to the Patchwork Rogue 20. So this has a bit less leather. Well, first of all, it's smaller. Like, let's call that what it is. This is a smaller bag. And while on the exterior, you're not dealing with a lot of leather, you're dealing with shirling, right? This is not a... And you're dealing with lots of it. <laughs> I mean, pretty much it's this side, it's this side. And then even where the zipper is, there's still more shirling here and here with this strip of leather. Now, this bag doesn't have nearly as much leather as the other bag I just showed you, but on the interior, they give you so many straps, guys. So you have this longer strap here. Let me see if I can like make this like slightly functional. <laughs> you have this long strap here. Then you have these, you know, this these handles here. And then you have another set of straps that are similar to the straps that I showed you on the other bag. So you're, it comes with, how many bags? Think about this. How many bags have you purchased that come with more straps than what's already attached to the bag? Most luxury houses, if the bag has these handles built in, that's all you're gonna get. You're not gonna get another two sets of straps here that are also made of leather. Where are they doing it at, coach? Then once again, in the interior, it's all leather, guys. It's all leather with the exception, again, of this right here in the middle that has this more woven material. But everything on the interior, it's leather. It's all leather. The tags, guys, the handles, leather. All of it is leather. And so with these bags, you're just really getting your bang for your buck. I know it can be a little painful to pay $900, $1,000 for a coach bag. And you feel like, well, I might as well go to Gucci or I might as well go to Louis Vuitton and pay a little bit more money. But remember, 
a lot of the more entry-level Vuitton pieces are canvas. They're not leather. A lot of those Gucci pieces nowadays, from what I see especially, are more expensive than just paying $1,000. And again, these are pieces you gotta remember. I understand it's the name. You feel like coach shouldn't be so expensive, but there are certain pieces that they have available that I 100% think are worth it, worth the investment that will stay for a very, very long time. And sometimes you just have to get over that mental hurdle of this is not worth this because of the name or because of your expectations for that brand. Example, Chanel. One would believe Chanel should be worth $10,000. But if you assess their quality today versus their quality 10 years ago, you'd be like, oh wait, the quality today isn't worth $10,000. I need to reassess whether or not it's worth the money. And just because Chanel is Chanel, perhaps that doesn't mean that bags should automatically be $10,000. So sometimes we just have to reframe our thinking a little bit, especially in this day and age where inflation is crazy. Brands are hiking up their prices like crazy while the quality continues to go down, while the packaging continues to go. I mean, I could talk about this for days. But getting back to the plot, are Coach Rogues worth the money? They 100% are. Coach has been stepping their game up like I haven't seen before. I used to wear Coach a lot as a young girl because that was my mom's go-to brand. I used to have a little crossbody messenger bag in middle school. Like that was our jam. And for a while there was a lull. They were dealing, they were struggling with their brand identity a little bit. However, I definitely think they found it. They found their fit, they found their groove, they found out where they excel at, and they're doing a really great job. So net net y'all, I just say don't sleep on the Coach Rogue. I know it's a little bit more expensive, but the quality, if you're looking for quality handbags, they're there guys. I don't make a commission from this. I don't make any money from this. This is just a handbag enthusiast keeping it all the way 150% <laughs> and just someone who's been loving what the brand has been doing as of late. I believe some of the styles that I showed you are sold out, but they still have a number of beautiful buttery looking rogues that are still on the Coach website. And if you're looking for a handbag that's really going to last you, that you can have for a long time, my bags are a little unique, but there are a number of rogues in black and brown Bags that you can take to work every day. Bags that you can wear to brunch with your girls on the weekend, right? There's a number of bags that they have available that would be perfect for your wardrobe and would last you a very long time and would go with pretty much anything you have in your wardrobe. I know that price tag. I, I know that price tag will make you go, ooh, ooh. But I'm telling you, it's well worth the money. Coach is doing it right. But y'all, that's the end of my video. Thanks for hanging out with me today. If you like what you heard, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be posting more videos like this around handbags, fragrance, luxury in general. But anyways, come back for more and I'll see y'all later. Bye.